Is that him? One to the right. Shoot him. Shoot him. Shoot him. Shoot him. Nice. Where are you aiming? Huh? Where are you aiming? The chest. The chest? Oh, the chest. Yeah. Okay. One from like his head down to here. I couldn't see it, but I knew the way that he was looking. Down in here. So you hit him on the front of the shoulder. Correct. You hit him in the chest. Angling through it. But, yeah. Right. Shoot him. I hit him that time. I hit him. Congratulations. Very sir. exciting. Well done. Very exciting. Well done. Nice. Oh, that was great. That was cool. Good it's job. Fun, man. <laughs> it's fun when he's down. It's not fun when he's not down because then you're chewing on your fingernails. These guys told me to shoot. I shot. I fucked it up. Now we're in the mud all day. <laughs> Come with me. See the spine line? Yep. You see where that blood where is? Where the blood is? To the left. Right in the middle. Just put it on the spine. There we go. Perfect. Very good. It's and one high in the back. That, that was the second one when he was running away uh -huh. when we first kicked him up. Tired. Adrenaline dump. <laughs> that was a fun hunt. That was very cool. It's not easy at all. It's uh, much harder than I thought it was gonna be. Much harder. And uh, you don't put him down with the first shot, you start worrying, and that was me today. An easy bunch up with the group of you. And he was laying down under that tree. That's where he was yeah, yeah. with them, they all protecting him. And yeah. And I thought it was strange that they weren't just gushing off. They were right. They kind of held held tight. Held tight for a long time. Even when they took, even when they went this way, they didn't just blast Correct. off. They just a slow trot. And at some point, they were just walking away. It's right. almost trying to hang back with him, probably, to keep them together. Oh, you just you just broke that shoulder on your yeah. first shot. Did I? Yeah. Yeah. You did indeed. You can see how hopefully, it's hopefully, maybe there will be some fragments that eat lung, but but that little fragments is just to, uh, gives him another hole to breathe through. Right. Let's check his eyes. Is he blinking? Nope. Yeah, he's done. Congratulations, Lady Nice. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Mr. Anthony. Thank you. It's a privilege to do it again with you. Here we are, day three. I'm back in South Africa again, in the uh, Limpopo province, with Africa Maximum Safari, with my good friend. Northwest, sir. Northwest? Yes, sir. Okay, my good friend, Johnny, <laughs> BH. Uh, we, uh, we hunted a different farm past two days. Uh, very difficult, pursued them, lost them. It's, so we tried something different. We came to a different area today and uh, we found a herd that was out in a large area. The grass here is very high, about four feet high. And we started making a move towards them. Then the other PH that was with us, TJ spotted a small group of bulls that were together by themselves. So we started following up towards them. And uh, at some point we lost our shoes, socks, everything. And then it was a barefoot true African safari in That's fashion. That's right. Pretty <laughs> some good old turf. Yep. And they, uh, they went further than what we had expected, but we kept on them. And they, uh, this guy here finally gave us a shot. He was with two or three other ones. And the way he was facing us, I miscalculated which way he was facing. So when I shot him, I hit him in the shoulder and broke his shoulder, but it didn't pass through his vitals. 
Either way, the trackers were on them. We had some blood. We followed them, and uh, we picked up the uh, a group of bachelors that were all together underneath the tree, and he was in the middle of them resting. Uh, once we bumped them up and he took off, he was the last one at the end. We realized that he was the one that I did, in fact, hit the first time, and uh, the barrage started. We Everybody just started shooting at him, and uh, a couple good shots put him down. He died here in the middle of this open area here, and then uh, a couple finishing shots, and mm -hmm. he let out the bellow, and that was it. Yep. So, Mr. Anthony, it's been a hard, tough three days. Absolutely. You've done a true buffalo hunt this time around. And, yes. Uh, I think we got you an amazing bull, a barefoot, mature bull. Barefoot, hands and knees and all. We did a barefoot, hands and knees. We at least got a foot pedicure for nothing. It didn't cost <laughs> us $50. And um, yes, it was a great hunt. It was a successful hunt. And um, it was an exciting hunt. It's a tough and hunt. It's very difficult. Much wanted. more difficult than I thought it was going to be. Yes, sir. We've put in a good 11 miles in the last... Uh, Absolutely. More than 11 miles in today, the Today, I think we did days. two miles today. If yeah, we did, right. what, four and that's then seven. Right. So, yeah. So, so, it's been an exciting trip. And we had a great hunt. And thank you to all the trackers for tracking them all down. Thank you yeah. to TJ for all his assistance. And uh, it's been awesome. It's been yes. great. Mr. It's Anthony, cool. well done. Thank you, Johnny. And we're pleased to have you get this beautiful buffalo. Thank you. Thank you, sir.